dolphins in Japan. It's dolphin hunting season. In recent days, Japanese fishermen have captured hundreds of them and herded them into a notorious cove. What happens in that cove each year used to be a well-kept secret, not anymore. A warning, it is extremely hard to watch. The dolphins thrash around fishing nets in vain, trying to get back to open water. This dolphin bloodies its bottled nose trying to escape. They're herded from the ocean by dozens of fishermen into the infamous Taiji Cove. Some of the pod, totaling more than 200 dolphins, according to an activist group, will be sold to marine parks and aquariums. Most of the others will be slaughtered for their meat. They hammer a metal rod into the spinal cord of the dolphin. These dolphins do not die immediately. It takes up to 20 to 30 minutes for these dolphins to die, where they bleed out, suffocate, or drown in the process of being dragged to the butcher house. It's a brutal spectacle that in years past has turned the water red with blood for hours. Organizers of the annual hunt for years had been able to keep cameras away, but then came the movie The Cove. The documentary won an Oscar and exposed the slaughter to the world. The filmmakers used an elaborate setup of hidden cameras to capture what they called this fishing village's hidden secret. Despite the international outcry, the Japanese government defends the practice, saying it's not only tradition, but also no different than the slaughter of any animal eaten in Western countries. People are just thinking too emotionally about the dolphins. They want to protect them just because they're cute and clever. Well, we're going to more on this story tomorrow night.